the most frustrating things a homeowner can deal with if they live next to a stormwater retention pond is pond weeds. There are three things that you can do to get rid of pond weeds in your pond. The first one is to manually remove them. With a rake or by hand, you can pull out those excess pond weeds and pull them up onto the shore. They'll dry out, become nice and light, and you can remove them. You can mulch mow them into your yard and they make really great compost. The second thing you can do is to chemically get rid of these weeds. Before you know what to spray on your pond or put in your pond for chemical removal of the weeds, you need to identify your weeds so you know what chemical to use. In most farm and home stores or co-ops, they have a whole section of pond chemicals that you can use to treat your pond weeds. Those chemicals can be applied by homeowners or your neighborhood associations, but there are some chemicals that professionals do need to spray. So just read the labels and follow the directions carefully. Be smart with the way that you're spraying. Make sure you know how much to spray and what you're spraying. Not every chemical is for all plants. And then the third thing you can do, um, certain pond weeds are consumable by certain fish, like grass carp. Unfortunately, the filamentous algae, that pond scum that floats on top of the water, grass carp don't like to eat that, but there are some other rooted plant materials that grass carp love to eat, and so if you have those in your pond, grass carp are a biological option to get rid of those pond weeds. If you want to prevent these pond weeds from growing, there's a few things that you can do. Keep from feeding geese. Don't feed the geese and keep them staying at your pond all winter long. You can keep the water moving by adding an aerator or a fountain. That moving water keeps algae and some pond weeds from being able to grow and take over your pond. Also avoid over fertilizing. That over fertilization of a lawn or extra fertilizer outside your lawn washes into your pond, causing your pond weeds to grow instead of your grass. For more information, visit your local extension office or visit our website at kansasgreenyards.org.